Howdy folks, welcome back to Out of War. I've been digging and digging and digging, as you can see, back into here. And finally made it to level 22. So that means we've unlocked explosives and we've also unlocked the fuel truck. So we're going to do some boom boom today. I'm going to fill in some blocks right there. But if you're not familiar with explosives, let's go take a look. Uh, we've got everything except the plowshare. The plowshare is a nuclear. Nuclear? I think I said nuclear. I'm a hillbilly. What can I say? <laughs> nuclear device. Uh, it just removes voxels. And it goes boom. I think another one of these maybe just removed explosives. Or removed voxels. I don't remember for sure. It goes boom. Uh, I tend to use Anfo a lot. It's got a six meter blast radius. Six and a half, seven. Might go for some, should we go for RDX? It's a hundred more bucks. It doesn't really, yeah, let's just go for Anfo. Anfo works well. And I'm just gonna grab some because we're gonna be using a lot. So I've been digging back into there and then also dug back into here, into this coal seam. Let's zoom out a little bit. You see it kind of goes up into the hill there. So I've got quite a bit of coal out of there. I put down some steel mesh here so I can drive over that to ground that coal. But uh, let's get some explosives put down and get some boom boom. So I've got the side trays kind of set up here to hopefully catch a lot of this coal. I not quite reach that. There we go. Now you can lay this out with a steel mesh ceiling so it's a nice even grid, but I tend to just throw it up there. Like so. Get right up. There. Alright. So we'll do a little blast here just so you can kind of see what's up and we'll see how we get along. So fire in the hole! Fire in the hole. So we get a lot of material. That'll all filter down and hopefully it doesn't stop up here. Yeah, we got uh, about three conveyors going there, so that's pretty good. So there you have it. So the plan is to bring down all this coal. Just gonna go ahead and smooth that out. We'll lose a little bit of material, but that's okay. So let's get some more coal down. Didn't realize I couldn't quite reach up here. Almost need a ladder. <laughs> get back in here. So I may just bring this down in sections. Let's come out here. And they blast off with a slight delay in between, and it's based on the order you place them down. It's gonna hop up here. There we go. Careful, I'll hit the right button here, or I'll detonate it right over my head. No player damage in yet, so it wouldn't be the end of the world. But, whoa, look out. We're getting a little bit of grass poking up through there. Let's get rid of that. Okay, let's do another shot. Fire in the hole! So you can see, you can quickly get a lot of material down. We got all the conveyors dumping in there. Hopefully it can keep up. That'll be processing for a while. But we've got most of that coal. Let's just chase the seam a little further. If I get all this coal out. Interesting. Ooh, look out. That only follows. Only snaps at certain points on the conveyors. 
And you can't look straight up, so you kind of kind of do this a little goofy sometimes. Get rid of these blocks. Like I was saying, another way to do this, uh, if you bring up like a grid and you can put you can put these ceiling tiles up, and then the explosives will snap to the middle of that, and then that makes a nice even grid. But I usually just place it by hand. Not too worried about it. Fire in the hole. Smooth out these little floating chunks. Uh, is that? S I'm not sure what that is up there. Might be a little bit of coal at the surface. Got just a little more down here. That chased out, and then up on top here. Can I jump? Jump! Jump! <laughs> Can't quite reach. Now I can reach. Oh, I got it. Professional. All right, make sure we're on demolish. Review, and got a little bit of dirt poking through. All right, here we go again. Fire in the hole. Nice. Yeah, I think that's pretty much all of that coal seam. So I'll kind of dress this up now. We're going to lose a little bit of material, but it's just dirt, a little bit of pay dirt. Not a big deal. Clean that up a bit. So this is all pay dirt back in here. I might, might turn this into a mine uh, once we get to level 40 and we can do the underground mining. But I think this is as far as I'm going to go there right now. Let's run up here and take a look up top. Already over 3 million. That's going to be chugging for a while. Oh, I see. So the little, little bit of coal goes right up through here, it looks like. Interesting. Throw that there for a reference point. Okay, so that's probably this seam right here. So it might be worth digging that direction, get some of that coal. Of course, we got this other part over here. Fairly substantial. I don't know how deep it goes. Uh, that coal, I, I don't think, did it go underneath here? I don't think it went down any. Let me, uh, let me remove some of these. Oh, no, it did go down. Okay. We could go down a level. Mine that. Interesting. He straights back on. Well, for now, let's explore... Explore this vein. Scene. What we're going to call it. I think we need to be about... Four wide, probably. And I wonder if I should... Nah, I was thinking about getting the excavator down here. We can just do it with the uh, front loader. Old reliable. in here and then we can just dump. A 
little bit of spillage. Oh, wheel loader, you're not wanting to uh, bite in there too good for some reason. That goes down as well. Of course, we still got that lithium deposit over by the starting area. I'm kind of wanting to go uh, start excavating on that. If it's big enough, might have to do some uh, exploration. I've been digging a lot of coal. It'd be kind of nice to mix it up a little bit. Is this going back? Looks like it is kind of back in there. This was large enough. I could even lower this whole thing and put a side channel in, but I don't, I don't think it's big enough to warrant all that work. I think we can just dig it out. Let see. Are we still spitting out over here? I think the blast is done. Yeah, the blast is done here. It's just got to make it all the way up the hill now. I don't know how much how much more is left. So a little bit of blasting. I know the parking brake's active. I put it on. Silly loader. And we'll kind of use that sparingly where it makes sense, the explosives. I think it's it's a little cheesy just to have a massive conveyor of belts and explosives. Nothing wrong with that. That's just not what I want to do on this particular season. Did some of that in the last season. I think, like I said, I think we might move back up to that Lillian deposit. Up by the starting area. Let's see what it would take to start mining that out. So I don't plan to go too far from the starting area until we have the large haul trucks unlocked, and that's that's quite a ways away. <laughs> we got a lot of digging to do before we get to that spot. I do want to pick off one more chunk there. Do this. This is kind of our side entrance. There we go. Something like that. And I want to build an actual mine entrance here at some point. We do decide to pursue mining into here. I mean, we might even mine into here and hit something over there under the starting area. But that's, I believe, level 40. Let me just double check. We got vehicles underground. So, yeah, level 40 for this guy. But it's tunnelers. So, we got a ways to go, but let's look at dumpers. So, 37 for the first guy here. Lots of, lots of leveling left to do. Tell you what, for this video, let's finish out by moving back up the hill and we'll kind of start taking a look at that lithium deposit. I'd like to get some more of that out. I think we're going to need at least the wheel loader, probably the excavator at some point. We'll run the wheel loader up for now. Everything kind of parked down here. <laughs> Worked out pretty nice. For the size equipment, the road is just right. It would need to be bigger and wider, of course, for the large haul trucks. But we can cross that bridge when we get to it. That's a long ways out. A 
little bit cloudy today. Up the hill. One last pull. Now, I'm trying to remember, how do I get over there? I don't remember if I showed it. I moved the fuel over there. I can't remember if I showed that on video or not. Get that all cleaned up. Move the fuel over to that spot. A little bit of digging here. There's just a little bit of coal here. Mucked around a little bit. Let's head up top. I hope with the drivetrain update we get some more variation in like engine sound and stuff. It's very monotone. It doesn't sound like a big heavy machine working. So all of this may get redone. Let's get down on this level and I'm going to open the floor back up. See where that lithium was exactly. We might just be completely redoing this area. Let's take a look here. Is it out here, maybe? Where was the lithium? There it is. I might want to continue that ramp. My thought was maybe to have a spiral ramp around the outside of the deposit, but I'm not sure. I just I don't remember for sure what this looked like under here. So there it is. How do we get it out of there? <laughs> I think I was digging with the excavator doing that. I think I'm going to have to pretty much get rid of all of this and might even have to redo how we uh, get it transported over. So let's go, let's go delete. I'm going to leave the wood retaining wall there. Let's go down to this section. of a pain deleting this because the debris blocks your ray cast. Kind of wish the particles didn't have physics. Didn't block stuff. But it is what it is. I think I've complained about that before. So I'll shut up now becomes a bit of a chore to build stuff. Help! Stuck!
Okay, got that all out. Is there anything over here? I think this might just be pay dirt. Well, yeah, that street kind of. And it continues, doesn't it? Take the dirt elevator back up. Yep. <laughs> Realism. Interesting. So that little streak kind of continues. This is where we were digging with the excavator. Okay, well, maybe we need to get rid of all this too. what I've deleted and what I haven't because sometimes they don't break. Sometimes you click and the stuff's in the way. The spam. Kablamo! Okay, get that out of the way. Let's get this out of the way. What if we even need that ramp up to the top? Maybe we should come in from over there. But I'll leave that there for now. The more I'm thinking, the more I'm thinking we might just come in from over there. I think there was lithium. I think that's why I put this here, if I remember right. There was lithium under here. Then that interferes with our pole belt, but might get rid of this and we can rebuild it at some point or make it go up and over something else. So let's get rid of this. Just getting rid of everything today. Take those sections out. And we're going to start digging. Find the good stuff. Here, I'll put you there. All right, let's get the wheel loader. See if we can get back over there, and we'll start coming this way. And you now that I think about it, let's let's just get rid of this ramp. Doesn't need to be here. This whole thing's getting redone. Do 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 do. Clicky clicky. block hiding down there. There, have one. Okay, let's get to digging. We can. Let's see if we can get over there. It's a little rough over here. That's why I had the uh, concrete down. Good 
get the bucket away from that, it'll re-solidify. Kind of make our way over here. pickle here in a minute. We go push the bucket. <laughs> Uh-oh. Go go grippy wheels. There you go. Resolidify. You get up over this hump and then we're home free. There you go. Alright, we can kind of bump our way down over here. And we're golden. My question is, where was that uh, original lithium vein that I was chasing over here? There it is. I think it's right under here. It's kind of where I had that wood. All right, so we need uh, we need a new place to dump. That's what we need. Time to redesign the mine site. Get at least most of this to go in the conveyor. Yep. I thought I saw lithium under there, but I didn't. Alright, let's see. We Do we have any pieces left? We've got plenty of straights. I have a right. Uh, I need a left. And, a, and an up. I've got an up. I can use my right. Or I just want to be straight there. Maybe I just want to be straight. Something like that. some ramps. Uh, I really want that deeper, but I think this will work to get started. It'll work for now. It's not ideal. Like I said, not ideal, but it'll it'll get us started, I think. That's the main thing. I tend to iterate. Now I can grab a scoop full, I can dump it over here. And we'll just use that existing drop where the coal used to go. This will get us started and then we'll do something better. 
So what I need to do here the, before the video gets too long, I need to find this lithium deposit. I see remnants of it, but I think a lot of this might just be from spillage. It's hard to tell the way it like regrows. Yeah, this is far from ideal, but it'll work. Then the plan would be to just mine to the east there. I'm thinking that's east, right? Bit a map. Yeah, I'm calling straight up north, so hopefully that's accurate. We'll mine to the east and then hit that other larger vein, because I think it might be all part of one vein. Yeah, we're definitely getting some lithium down here. So I'll be doing some digging here and kind of uncover the node and see where we're at, and then we'll probably have to completely redo our loading station here. It really needs to be lower down. keeps filling in the dirt, but when I scoop, you can see underneath there, that's all lithium underneath there. Three point one mil, nice. <laughs> Get off there, rocks. Is doing. Get in there. Bonk. Nope. Yeah, they're they're dirt locked to the top of the bucket. Go we'll figure. All right, let's widen this up a bit. Yeah, I think I'm going to want to come over one more with a up conveyor. Get this lower down. Back up out of the hole. Come on, 501. You got this. Where's all that lithium at? He's filling in with pay dirt, which is okay, I guess. Could be worse. So what are the big wheel loaders unlock at? No, not vehicle options. Store vehicles. So the 510 unlocks at 23. I don't think it's any... 420 horsepower, 8 ton. 420 horsepower, 8 ton. Why would you pick this one? Just because? Something different? I don't know why it unlocks at such a higher level. Then these guys, from what I understand, they're not worth using right now because they use big voxels. You actually get like less money for space. But we're we're a long ways off from those. I have to worry about that. So that other wheel loader is the exact same specs as this one. I think this is about the best wheel loader in the game. Sure done a ton of work for me. Some more lithium now. We're dropping stuff everywhere. I need to smooth this out. So let's do the old tabaruni. There we go. Get the roller back up top. Just start moving equipment back up as we need it.
little ice on this thing. <laughs> and we need to smooth out the whole road anyways. Make a smooth run. So pretty good progress so far for me, as much as I get to play. I know all the other YouTubers are like level 40 and you know, doing awesome. I just, I don't have that kind of time, unfortunately. But we're a little bit behind, but that's okay. I'm still having fun. And uh, the videos are still doing well, so it looks like you guys are having fun too. Appreciate the support. Get this rolled out and then we'll move the loader. Get your big old butt out of the way there, 501. Whee! <laughs> okay. I didn't find the magic pixel to get in. One spinny thing, I'm trying to earn a living here. Just pull up into there, that'll work. Yeah, I could use the pickaxe tool, but and I do sometimes. It's nice to use the equipment for what it's intended for. Once in a while. There we go. That's a little better. All right, back into the hole. Go make some money. This pater is not the best for XP, but I believe the more expensive the item, the better the XP. With pay dirt, you need volume to get the gold and stuff out of it. It's a lot of volume. As we get into this lithium, it's going to help us level up. And actually, I think I'll close out the video. I'll, you can buy material and you can get XP that way. Just uh, you can't sell it to the coal plant. So you only get half the XP that you would if you mined it. But that is a thing you can do. So let's spend, say, a million. And we'll see what we get. We'll go to store materials. What's the most expensive material? Uh, do, 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 do. Diamond, ruby, platinum, jade, jade type is the most. Okay. Oh, that's a lot of J-type. Let's do all those. Crank those all up to 99. I don't know if this is even worth it, but... We've got plenty of money. We're going to be making plenty of money on the road to level 37 for the big stuff. Not too worried about it, so... There we go. 635 grand worth of jade tight. So I can buy that. Now I've got 2k worth of jade tight here. We go to store sell. We can sell that back. So we lost oh what 200 grand? So we spent six we'll call it 640 and we're making 440. And we are 376 389. So we got quite a big chunk towards level 23. So that's something you can do. You can turn money into XP like that. Just keep in mind, like I said, if you sell to the coal plant, you get twice as much XP and about 30% more money, roughly. But if you're making tons of money and you need the XP, that's something you can do. There we go. I'm going to keep digging into here and searching out this lithium vein. I know there's a bunch of lithium underneath here. And then I don't know if it's the same vein, but it comes over here too 
We're gonna be digging out all this stuff. And I'll probably end up redoing some of the loading conveyor section here. Get that all sorted out, make it a little more efficient. Let's get you out of the way. But uh, yeah, until then, I'm going to keep on digging. Thanks as always for watching, and I'll catch you in the next video. Take care.